in the moment tonight, I want to talk to you about this saying. Now, we've heard it before um, a lot. If you fly, you hear it a lot. The flight attendant says to you, before you put the mask on the person next to you, on your on a child or on a family member, put the mask on yourself. Now, that's some real stuff, right? And and, and I and I wonder. I think we should do a better job of applying that to our life and, and how we choose to live our life. Before you can help somebody else, before you can deal with someone else's stuff. Before save your daughter or save your son or save your brother or save your sister you have got to save yourself now stay with me and i'll bless you on this and i mean that you can't have anxiety and depression and issues of loneliness in your life and try to help somebody else in their life you've got to own your stuff own your stuff own your issues Fess up to your issues. Save yourself. Heal yourself. Work, encourage yourself before you can try to save somebody else. And, and, and it, it, it bothers me to know and to see those people that pour everything into their children and they pour nothing into themselves and they wonder why their kids are all screwed up. And here's why. Because your kids are a reflection of who you are. And if you have your internal issues and your stuff, that you haven't dealt with, you haven't unpacked, you haven't healed, you can't pour into them because you're a broken vessel. And how can a bucket that has a hole in the bottom pour water in to a bucket without a hole in the bottom? That bucket that you're pouring water into is not going to get enough water. That is why the flight attendants tell you before you are able-bodied enough to save your child, you have to be breathing first. So I say this to you tonight to say, if you are out there and you feel as though it is your job to save somebody else, to fix somebody else, to deal with somebody else's stuff or somebody else's issues or somebody else's drama, think about this first. Have you dealt with your drama? Have you dealt with your issues? Have you dealt with the issues facing your heart, the issues in your spirit, the issues that keep you up at night? Because if you haven't dealt with your stuff first, you are incapable, incapable of dealing with or saving somebody else. And to that fact, you will never save them because you have not focused on saving yourself. So tonight, I say to you, before you take on somebody else's burden, before you try to fix somebody else's life, fix yours first. Put the mask on yourself. Like the flight attendant says, if this cabin loses pre air pressure, oxygen mask will descend from above. Put the mask on yourself first before helping a child or a family member next to you. Think about that for a second. How can you assist them if you are not getting enough oxygen to your brain? And think about that in life. How can you save somebody else if you're not saved yourself? How can you fix somebody else's depression issues if you're depressed yourself? How can you fix somebody else's anxiety issues if you are, if you are anxious yourself? How could you work on somebody else's stuff and you could... Try to fix them, whether it be their sexuality or who they choose to be with or their finances, if you can't fix yourself. Huh? Answer that question for me. But the truth of the matter is, and like I said at the beginning of this, a bucket with, wa a, bucket with a hole in the bottom filled with water cannot pour in enough water into the bucket next to them without a hole. So fix the hole in your bucket before you start pouring into somebody else's bucket. Truth be told, truth of the matter.